faster we get vaccinated, the faster our economy can fully reopen. We're talking no restrictions. Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham says we've got to get to 60% of the eligible population fully vaccinated for that to happen. Tonight, we're around 45%. Now, earlier this year, our Four Investigates team found really eager New Mexicans who were planning vaccination trips to nearby states so they could get those shots faster. Brittany Costello found out it's actually a potential problem for us, Brittany, because the state has to be able to factor those folks into our vaccination rate. Yeah, Tessa, state officials say they are attempting to collect that data from surrounding states, both by reaching out and using a federal database. But they say if you were vaccinated elsewhere, you can help by registering with the state. We are at a point where every vaccination matters. We are three hours into our trip to Amarillo to come get our second booster shot. Remember these folks? Those so eager for shots, they took a vaccination vacation to Texas. Our four investigates team spoke to them back in March. I'm primary caretaker for my 90 year young mother, and I wanted to make sure that we got her her shot, I got mine, and we were all safe. And I really didn't want to wait till June or July. State health officials say they are using a federal database to access the number of people vaccinated out of state. I think it's also possible. We heard a lot about people in the southeastern part of the state going across either one of those two borders, the eastern or southern border, to get their vaccine in Texas. It's possible they may not be uh, in the system or their data might not have percolated its way through. But health officials say they are working to determine what those numbers are. We've worked with one partner in Texas and have requested that information regarding how many New Mexicans have received at least one dose in Texas, but have not received that um, response yet, but that has been promised to us. One way to ensure we get credit Go online and enter your information. Health officials say you can put in your vaccination information from wherever you got it. That's a really easy way to bring county vaccinations up is to identify those people who've gotten the vaccines elsewhere. Again, we do not have data on how many New Mexicans have received their vaccines out of state, but Dr. Scrace says using the federal database, he believes that number to be in the single digit percentage. Tessa.